As some of you may know, I've been creating some Terraria content, a game that I've grown quite fond of. If you look at my Steam hours, you'll see that Terraria is my second most played game, with over 350 hours to date. However, my all-time favorite game is TF2, and I've spent nearly four times as many hours playing TF2 compared to Terraria. But let's just shift the focus of this video. Today, I want to talk about market gardening, or specifically, how I can bring this iconic TF2 maneuver into the world of Terraria. Now, you might be wondering, what exactly is market gardening? Let me explain. Market gardening is the art of launching yourself into the air and landing a critical hit on an enemy before touching the ground. It is a skillful and satisfying move that can deal massive amounts of damage to your enemies. So, without further ado, let's dive right into this and see how we can bring market gardening into Terraria. Let's start with finding a melee weapon, or specifically, a weapon that would allow me to do more damage when I'm in the air because as cool as that shovel is, I'm not going to be able to do much damage with it. How about a lance? The lance is a weapon that would allow me to do more damage the faster I'm moving, so let's see if this weapon would allow me to do extra damage while falling in the air. Nice. Now we need to find something that will allow me to get up high in the air. Let's try the rocket launcher. Yeah, no, although it gives me some knockback, the height won't be enough to do the damage I want. So, how about a mount? The UFO mount and the pirate ship mount give me good speed horizontally, but not vertically. So, how about the queen slime mount? With the queen slime mount, I am able to get high into the air without much of a hassle, and quite easily land next to my targets to inflict massive damage that I want to do. Alright, perfect. Now let me add some more damage accessories and armor, we should be good to go. Now, let's see this in action with the King Slime boss. 